Hi, how are you? Okay, so I got new glasses and I got to wear them for the first time to school because I got them over the weekend. And um, I've never had, my son has my chair, so I have to improvise. I've never, it's been a very long time since I've had full rim coverage. I usually get, um, you know, the wireless on the bottom. So I did my makeup today in a way to highlight my eyes. Now, does that mean if you wear glasses, you have to do your makeup like this every time? No, it's your makeup. You wear the, you wear what you want. But I wanted to show you in case you were interested, glasses tend to put a shadow. You can see some of the shadows, okay? They tend to make it dark behind there. So one of the things you can do to help counteract that is your makeup. Change your makeup up a little bit. Keep it nice and light. So I used a very light brown. It's called Idealistic. I don't think it's in stock right now. Um, I, idealistic right there and I used an old cream shadow that's my favorite and I can't remember the name right now it's a splurge cream shadow it's full of glitter it's just beautiful but you could substitute that with optimistic or your favorite lighter metallic and I say metallic or sparkly because you need something that's going to catch the light to bring your eyes out of the shadow does that make sense you could do matte, you could totally do matte. I just think a metallic would be a little more reflective and bring out your eyes a little more. I also keep it very tamed down on the liner. So I just did proper liner, tight lining, and then your mascara as usual or as you see fit. The rest of my face is, you can just ignore it because I had problems this morning and it's the end of the day. This is what we have now. This is not an indicator of how well the concealer works. I didn't use the concealer properly this morning. Yada, 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 you don't care. I just wanted to come on and say, sometimes when you wear glasses, you get shadows on your eyes. And if you want a way to kind of counteract that sometimes, then think light, light and bright. Okay, you still use your transition shade if, or just use the color if you have the liquid shadow referent. That would be an excellent choice to bring out your eyes and glasses. There you go, there's your little tip for the day. Thanks for watching. Bye. Have a good day. Bye.